story time with Madame Delina. Hello, boys and girls. How are you today? Madame Delina's delighted to see you again to finish our story about being perfectly different. Do you remember what our story is about? Well, Billy has many wonderful friends, but they all look different, wear different clothes, and are good at different things. So he asks his mother if one is better than the other. His wise mama says that everyone is important and that it's okay to look different. But Billy has more questions. So sit comfortably and let's dive right in. Part two of Perfectly Different. It's wonderful, said mama, that we all have different ways one was loud, we'd really have noisy days. But if everyone was quiet, we'd need a bit of speech. So the very best solution is to have a bit of each. Belly said to Mama, What do you think of this? A friend of mine runs really fast, a girl she'll never miss. But another friend is very slow and doesn't score at all. Every time I try to pass, he never gets the ball. That's absolutely fine, Mama then exclaimed. If he always tries his best, he should never feel ashamed. I bet he's great at something else. Perhaps he's brilliant on swings or superb at doing sums. We're all good at different things. Think about it, boys and girls. We're all good at different things. What are you good at doing? Dancing? Drawing? Telling stories? Playing sports? Running around? Telling jokes? There's one more thing. Thing, said Billy, that I need to find out. A friend of mine wears shiny clothes. He loves to pose and pout. But another friend wears simple things like plain shorts and a sweater. I think they both look really nice, but tell me which is better? It's splendid, Mama laughed, to wear whatever feels right, whether it's pyjamas in the day or an overcoat at night. But if everyone wore shiny clothes, they'd soon lose their appeal. And if everyone wore plain clothes, we'd all want a brighter deal. What do you like to wear? Do you choose your own clothes in the morning? Madame Delina loves to wear big beaded earrings like these ones that look like hundreds and thousands of sprinkles. Different chords in a choir create the perfect tune. It takes lots of different characters to make the best cartoon. Different color flowers create the perfect bunch. It takes different types of food to make your favorite lunch. What is your favorite lunch, boys and girls? Madame Delina loves to eat shrimp and spinach stew with rice and candy floss for dessert. Mmm. And although the earth is blue and green, it's friends with the white moon. And although December is really fun, so is the month of June. It takes a bit of everyone to make the perfect crowd and it really doesn't matter if you brown, white, quiet or loud. The end. What a fantastic story that shows us that we should all be proud of how different we look. Because you see, boys and girls, that's what makes us feel special and unique. We should never be ashamed of how we look. Remember what Billy's wise mama said. Everyone is beautiful, a perfect piece of art. But what really matters most 
is the kindness in your heart. And don't you ever forget that. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye for today. I'll see you next time. So hip, hip, hooray! Hey, boys and girls, subscribe, like, and share. Yeah.